Hello kids! Welcome to our class. Today we're going to see a new story. This is the story of Ricky Rabbit. You can use your pace of animal science or word building. Page 1. Ricky Rabbit dearly loved to run. He was a wonderful runner. When a race began, he was always right out in front. And no one ever caught up with Ricky Rabbit. He really had a knack for running races. One day, Ricky Rabbit woke up just not feeling too well. He couldn't tell exactly where he hurt, but he just felt tired and lazy and not ready for the day. Oh, groaned Ricky Rabbit, I don't feel well. What's the matter, Ricky Rabbit? asked his mother. I don't know exactly, Mom. I just don't feel well. Oh, why don't you rest a while instead of running out to play right away? I think I will, said Ricky Rabbit, falling back down on his soft bed of leaves and grass. I think my throat hurts. Go get a nice drink of cold water, maybe that will help. Then I think you should take it easy for a while, said Ricky Rabbit's mother. Ricky Rabbit giggled to himself as he came back from the cold river. Mom, since I'm a rabbit, I surely am glad it is my throat that is sore. Why is that, Ricky Rabbit? Since my throat is small, it doesn't hurt very much. But if my ears were sore, I will have a big pain because they are so long. His mother smiled. Page 2 that afternoon, Ricky Rabbit felt better, but he didn't seem to be as strong as before. A group of his friends came shouting, Ricky Rabbit! Ricky Rabbit! What is it? Ricky Rabbit asked. There's a new rabbit here and he wants to race with you. He must be pretty good, Ricky Rabbit. He thinks he can beat you. Oh no, Ricky Rabbit thought to himself. Today he probably can beat me. I just don't feel a bit like running. Come on, Ricky Rabbit, they said. He's waiting to run a race with you. Come on, everyone is waiting. Ricky Rabbit decided to go and see what this new super rabbit looked like. My, but he was big. For the first time in his life, Ricky Rabbit was not sure he could in come in first in a race. Coming in first has become a habit with him. Would it be fair to refuse to race just because he couldn't win? I like to win, but... Well, I guess I will run anyway, said Ricky Rabbit. Page 3 The runners lined up, the race started, and Ricky Rabbit jumped out ahead just as he always did. His heart began to pound, his throat hurt and his legs felt weak. Before long, the new rabbit ran past him. I may as well give up, Ricky Rabbit thought. I know now I can't win today. Why should I try? Just then, Ricky Rabbit heard a little voice from the rock path. Yeah, Ricky Rabbit. Come on, Ricky Rabbit. You can make it. It was Sammy Snail. No, I can't, Sammy Snail, Ricky Rabbit puffed. I'm tired out and half sick and I can't win the race. I don't think I can even finish the race. Yes, you can, Sammy Snail said, encouraging him. I just know you can. Ricky Rabbit didn't know whether he could or not. But if Sammy Snail thought he could, well, maybe he could go a little farther. That's the way, Ricky Rabbit, Sammy Snail said. Now, you can go just a little bit farther. You can make it if you try. I know you can. Ricky Rabbit was puffing now and his legs ached. But I can't win, Sammy Snail. Well, winning isn't everything, Ricky Rabbit. Just try to finish the race. It's always good to finish what you start. If you just keep on, I know you can finish. Ricky Rabbit could see the finish line now, but he wasn't sure his legs would carry him to it. I will try, Sammy Snail. 
Keep trying, Ricky Rabbit. You can do it if you just keep on trying. You can do even the hard things. Finish what you start. It makes you feel so much better. Page 4 Ricky Rabbit stumbled and almost fell, but he kept on going. He hurt all over, but he decided he would finish the race. Maybe he couldn't always win first place, but he could finish what he had started. As the new rabbit crossed the finish line, there were shots of the winner! The winner! New rabbit is finished! Ricky Rabbit could hear it, but he just kept on running. Winning is good, but finish what you start is very important. As Ricky Rabbit crossed the finish line, he heard Sandy Snail's small voice saying, Yeah, Ricky Rabbit! He finished what he starts! Yay, Ricky Rabbit! He didn't give up! Soon, all the animals were saying it too. Yay, Ricky Rabbit! He finished what he starts! Yay, Ricky Rabbit! Now, kids, it's very important that we do it like Ricky Rabbit. We need to finish what we start. Maybe it could look difficult, but God is with us. Don't give up. On page 6, color the picture. Have fun! On page 7, help the rabbit finish the race with your pencil. Thanks for watching. See you until next time. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video.